Honestly, how many moving videos can one person make in their life? <laughs> Hello siblings, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe and turn on those post notifications. Today, I am moving into my own apartment, finally! So if you haven't been keeping up, about a month ago, I moved to Houston, Texas. I moved in with my friends because my apartment wouldn't be ready until July 19th. Today is July 19th, so I am gonna be going and moving into my apartment today. I've got a couple friends who are gonna be helping me move. Um, so first off, we are gonna go pick up the U-Haul, load it up, and drive down to where my apartment is. It's actually like an hour away from here, so. <sighs> and then we also have to pick up bed, bed frame, and couch, all from Facebook Marketplace later today. So we've got a lot to do. Oh my gosh, the fog. All right, just got the U-Haul. My friend Abram is driving it back to the house and I'm gonna drive my car. I actually have to go to the bank because whenever I move in, I have to give them like the rest of first month's rent or like the rest of July's rent basically is how it works. But since I'm technically not in there yet, I don't know how to explain. Anyway, basically I have to bring a check and I don't have any checks, so I'm gonna go to the bank. <laughs> Okay, I will be right back. Little update, and I'm gonna tell you guys about this because I think it'll be a good like learning adult moment for anyone else who goes through this. So I went to my bank and they said that they don't do any personal checks. They could do a cashier check. Uh, the apartments didn't want a cashier check. They wanted a personal check. And so I was like, okay, well do you guys do money orders? Cause that was the other option. I have no idea what a money order is. And then she was like, no, but you can just go to Kroger and they do money orders. So I went to Kroger, literally just walked up to, they have like a station that is like, it literally says like money. And I walked over there. I literally just told them how much I needed on the money order. The actual money order itself cost less than a dollar. So then the rest of it was, it goes on the money order. And it literally looks like a check. Just like, it looks like a weird check. But it's essentially the same thing as a check. So basically I paid there with my debit card to Kroger and then Kroger writes this money order and then now I can give it to my apartment. So hopefully that makes a little sense. If you ever need a money order, you can get it at a lot of different places. Kroger's one of them. So there you go. There's your adulting advice or whatever for the day. Um, I'm gonna go back to the house. I actually can't be at my apartment to check in until three and it's 11. So I don't even need to leave here until like 1.30 or two. So I'm not in a huge rush. Okay, now I'm like out of gas, so I need to get gas, and today is turning into a very expensive day, renting the U-Haul, paying the rent, gas, <gasps> all my money, goodbye. I tried to do like a little braid, and it just made my hair look really naughty, but I didn't want my bangs down since we're moving today. Oh, I also got a Red Bull while I was at Kroger. One last stop, actually stopped at Sonic to get food for me and Abram since he's helping me move. And I always order on the app because it's half price all day. Happy hour all day. My drinks literally spilled. This is the second time Coke has spilled in my seat. Or in the floor that's on the seat, but you know what I mean. Oh my gosh. Okay, so not only did the Coke spill and my water spill, pretty much they're both almost empty at this point. I was just driving and the car in front of me just keeps slamming their brakes out of nowhere. And so it keeps falling. The water's still on the floor, but it just keeps falling because this guy doesn't know how to drive. So remember when you spilled your Coke? Yeah. <laughs> just feel how empty this is. See, this is why you never make fun of somebody <laughs> because then you're gonna do exactly it. So this is my U-Haul, it's the smallest one. It's just the 10 footer. And let's open her up. I don't know how to do this. Part 700. All of this must go. Here we go. Okay, we're almost done, and I did not realize from when I visited, I didn't remember that this room is huge. But I had so much stuff in here that you literally couldn't tell. So now the only thing left is like my gaming stuff, which I'm gonna put in the back of my car. The truck is loaded up, and there's still spare room. Yay! Uh, so we're gonna load every the rest of everything up. We'll go to my apartments, unload everything, and then we have to go buy a couch and a bed 
about those. So, still more of a long day to come. We've been doing this for like two hours maybe. I'm literally drenched in sweat. The Texas heat and humidity is really hitting. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are packed. See how much extra room there is? There's all this extra room. Yay! Both my TVs. Let's just hope that that doesn't just go. That would be bad. But everything, pretty solid. Sweat. Unfortunately. I am also drenched in sweat. My stomach is like sticky. Goodbye room. I mean, I'm sure I'll come stay here again, but goodbye. All right, we're officially on the move. We just left one in Charlie's house and we are an hour and 17 minutes away from my apartment. Here we go. And Abram's following me in the U-Haul. Oh my gosh, there was so much traffic. It literally took, I think, two hours to get here. But we're here. I'm gonna run in, do whatever I need to do, get the keys, and then we can start unloading. All right, here we are. And I already have a package. <laughs> All right, I haven't even seen this unit yet, personally. Oh my gosh, ah, two stories. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, well, let's bring this in. Oh my gosh, I'm in my own apartment. Ah, so excited. Let's get some light up in here. Super tall ceiling. Oh my gosh, there's so much room in like the dining room area. Kitchen, so cute. I'm gonna do a whole empty apartment tour, so I'm not gonna give that right now, even though I really want to, but I want it to be a whole separate video, so. I can't even tell you how bad I've wanted an apartment with two stories for so long. And now I have it. Here's my room. Ah, so cute. So it is at this point in the video that I mentioned in my empty apartment tour that my camera battery died. It was stuck inside of my camera, so I couldn't use it. My second camera was completely dead, so I had to throw it on the charger, but we had Facebook Marketplace deals to get to, so I couldn't vlog it, but that's what was happening. Also, I failed to mention, but remember how I said, I hope everything doesn't fall on my TVs? Both my TVs, let's just hope that that doesn't just go. Everything fell on my TVs and they're broken completely. At the time I was like too frustrated and a little bit embarrassed to show, but I'll show now. So that's what the TV looks like. And here's the other TV. So in the meantime, I charged my other camera and a lot has happened. So basically we went and picked up a couch, a table, a bookshelf, a bed, and a bed frame. So a lot, and it fits in the truck like perfectly. And we were really concerned, oh, and another TV. I bought a 75 inch TV for $400. I checked and there's nothing wrong with it. And like literally a 55 inch brand new is 400. So that was a steal. I hate that I had to spend money on a TV again, but it's the only option we have. But we just cleared out the living room so that we can bring it all in. We're exhausted. So hopefully we can bring it in. It's one of those Ikea Fahrenheit couches that pulls out to a bed and I'm so excited. I'll show you guys once it's in, but I'm gonna roll out the carpet. I can't decide which way I want the couch. This way or this way? So, TV on that bowl or that bowl? So we already brought in the bookshelf and just a few little things, but it is packed in there. We've got the TV, the couch, it like pulls out, pulls up, it opens. We've got a nice table, bed, and bed frame. Lags have showed up, okay. and now we are trying to gerrymander this couch. Okay. And then, you just have yeah, to set it. Go down and we're twist. I think you're gonna have to go out. Lower a little bit. Okay, there you go. There you go. Keep yep. going. Keep going. Yep. All right. Now we just have to twist it in. <laughs> nice, nice. We made it. Yeah, come back and set it down before we hit the fan. Yeah. Ah, twist, twist, twist. That was almost the fan. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, let's get it Yeah. Good morning, it is the next day and I am so 
unbelievably exhausted. Last night after we left the apartment, we went and got canes, which I ate for the first time. It was pretty good. I think it's a little overhyped, but like, I don't hate it. Like, I think it's a 10 out of 10, but I'm not like obsessed with it. I just don't really like chicken that much. Well, I do like chicken. I don't know. Anyway, moving on from that. Uh, my dad's actually going to be in town for the next few days, and he's going to help me just kind of get set up here and help me move, go buy more furniture if I need to. But um, here's my room. It's kind of a mess right now. I need a dresser. I need some nightstands. I need a makeup van and stuff like that. Um, my bathroom. I'm just kind of getting things somewhat unpacked. I'm so tired. All my clothes, just boneless. I need hangers. But I actually got a really solid amount of stuff unpacked yesterday. Like I have this whole bookshelf. All cute. Really like it. Oh, my dad's here. Hi. I literally, hey. oh, sorry. I literally had just started vlogging. I was like, my dad's in town. And then you knocked on the door. Perfect timing. <laughs> Hi. Love you. So I was about to tell you guys this. Yeah, those come off. But so when the couch comes all the way out, my dad has this. He was about to return it. I was like, wait, I can use that. So then when friends come oh, over, throw a sheet and it'll be super comfy. Oh yeah, that's gonna be really comfy. Yay. Let's try it out. Ah, nice. <laughs> Okay, well that's pretty much gonna be it for today's video. Uh, my parents are here and I have moved in a ton of stuff. I don't know why I did so much in one day. I'm literally tired and I got no sleep last night because I was worried I wasn't gonna wake up in time to go return the U-Haul. Oh, my dad's on hold. <laughs> But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. You guys stay tuned because I also have a shopping for furniture and stuff video coming soon because that's what we're gonna go do today for the rest of the stuff I need for my apartment. So definitely stay tuned. I have some fun videos and I'm super excited about my new adventure in my new place. I'm obsessed with it and I love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.